We do not want to see tents around the city um, any longer, so we need a larger shelter to house these individuals. One million dollars will pay for added services and a larger homeless shelter in Davidson County. This evening, Fox 8's Leah Sims takes us to 9th West Avenue in Lexington, where this new building will sit. She shares the need through the eyes of a man who struggled to get a roof over his head. Rick Romsey hit a rough spot in his life while driving trucks for a living. At one point, he found himself homeless. Really didn't have the support of family or friends or that of anybody else. During his desperate times, this was the place he called home. The First Hope Ministries Adult Homeless Shelter in Davidson County. I used this as a stepping stone to get where I actually needed to be in life. After a month, Ramsey renewed his CDL license and got back on the road. Right now, Davidson County's only homeless shelter can help seven families. But the heartbreaking is when families show up at our door and we can't house them. Ashley Phillips, the executive director of the shelter, estimates about 2,000 people in Davidson County are homeless, including 800 children. So drastically increasing numbers. Um, people are losing their jobs because of COVID. Um, there are homeless children out there that need our help. The new shelter calls for a 104 bed adult and family facility located here on West 9th Avenue, right next door to the Salvation Army. Now this $4.5 million project will also serve as a hub for nonprofits and governmental agencies who provide services for people right here in Davidson County. It's going to be a one stop shop um, for homelessness, for feeding, for clothes, for medical. Romsey hopes people see the value in this resource. I support anybody that can, t you know, go from a zero point in life to something productive and get their families back or, you know, money, house, whatever they need to be, you know, substantial in life. In Davidson County, Aaliyah Sims, Fox 8 News.